In the vibrant tapestry of life, Stoicism offers contrasting threads, each weaving its unique pattern. While the previous principle urged us to actively engage with the world, Stoicism also extols the virtue of solitude, a deliberate choice to embrace stillness amidst life's ceaseless demands. Subscribe, like, share. Understanding the virtue of solitude. A Stoic perspective. Solitude in Stoic philosophy is not a lonely exile from the world, but a purposeful retreat into oneself. It is a choice that allows us to sift through the noise, focusing on what is essential. As Marcus Aurelius reminds us in his timeless work, Meditations, very little is needed to make a happy life. It is all within yourself, in your way of thinking. In the solitude that Stoicism advocates, we find a sanctuary for self-discovery and introspection. Marcus Aurelius, the Stoic philosopher and Roman emperor, often retreated to the recesses of his mind, contemplating the nature of life and virtue. You have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this, and you will find strength, he asserts, emphasizing the control we possess over our internal thoughts, even in moments of seclusion. Meditations serve as a guide in understanding the virtue of solitude. It teaches us that being alone without distractions allows us to fully focus on tasks, a concept that aligns with the stoic principle of prioritizing what's in our control. Moreover, self-knowledge is paramount in stoic philosophy, and solitude provides the ideal environment for such introspection. In solitude, one can embark on a journey of self-reflection, questioning, and uncovering our deepest truths even if they are uncomfortable. Marcus Aurelius encourages us to turn inward, stating, Look within. Within is the fountain of good, and it will ever bubble up if thou wilt ever dig. Contrary to the notion that solitude is a problem to be avoided, Stoicism views it as an opportunity for personal growth. It allows us to be authentically ourselves and find profound meaning in life. As we detach from external distractions, we discover the power of simplicity, and the richness that comes with a life centered on virtue. Ultimately, the virtue of solitude, as advocated by Marcus Aurelius and Stoicism, lies not in isolation, but in the profound connection one establishes with oneself. It is a deliberate choice to step back, recalibrate, and foster a deeper understanding of our thoughts, values, and purpose. In the stillness of solitude, we find the strength to navigate the complexities of the world, rooted in the wisdom of ancient philosophy. Self-knowledge. Through solitude. Being alone, free from external distractions, provides an opportunity for deep self-knowledge. According to Stoicism, understanding oneself is the cornerstone of personal growth and virtuous living. Seneca, another prominent Stoic, emphasizes the importance of solitude, stating, a good conscience fears no witness, but a guilty conscience is solicitous, even in solitude. In the profound solitude advocated by Stoic philosophy, especially echoed in the timeless wisdom of Marcus Aurelius in Meditations, we find a space for profound self-discovery. Aurelius, a philosopher and Roman emperor, encourages us to engage in introspection and reflection as a means to comprehend the intricate depths of our character. In solitude, Away from the noise of external opinions and societal expectations, we have the opportunity to listen to the quiet voice within. This introspective journey is not merely an exercise in self-absorption, but a crucial aspect of Stoic teachings that underline the interconnectedness of our inner world with the broader cosmos. As Marcus Aurelius reflects on the transient nature of life, he encourages us to delve into the recesses of our minds. Solitude, then, is not an escape but a journey into the self, a pilgrimage towards self-awareness. It is a deliberate act, guided by stoic principles, to explore the vast landscapes of our minds. Through this exploration, we gain insights that transcend the ordinary, fostering personal growth and paving the way for a virtuous life. Introspection and personal growth Solitude is not a hurdle, but a stepping stone to personal growth. In moments of quiet introspection, we can question, reflect, and discover our deepest truths, even if they are uncomfortable. As Seneca wisely suggests, 
He who fears death will never do anything worthy of a man who is alive. In the profound silence of solitude, as Marcus Aurelius illuminates in his enduring work Meditations, we find the space to confront our innermost fears and desires. The Stoic philosophy encourages us to embrace discomfort as a catalyst for growth, and solitude provides the ideal environment for this transformative journey. Considered as a retreat into oneself, solitude becomes a sanctuary. Our Stoic philosopher and Roman emperor often retreated into the recesses of his mind, contemplating the nature of life and virtue, as he occasionally imparts in his journal. The Stoics, including Seneca and Epictetus, emphasize that solitude is not an escape, but a deliberate choice to sift through the noise and focus on what truly matters. It's an opportunity to detach from external distractions, facilitating a deep dive into our thoughts, values, and purpose. As Epictetus encourages us to make the best use of what is in your power and take the rest as it happens, solitude aligns with the Stoic principle of focusing on what's within our control. It enables us to cultivate self-awareness, a virtue highly prized in Stoic philosophy. Solitude, then, becomes a crucial element in the Stoic journey, a time for intentional self-reflection and a deliberate pause before navigating the complexities of the external world. In solitude, we discover the strength to face challenges and the resilience to persevere. Armed with the timeless wisdom found in Stoic philosophy, particularly in the writings of Marcus Aurelius, authenticity and meaning in solitude. Contrary to societal norms, Stoicism views solitude not as a problem to be avoided, but as an opportunity. It allows us to be authentically ourselves, free from external influences. In these moments, we find meaning and purpose that transcends the superficialities of everyday life. Solitude, then, is a canvas for self-exploration and the cultivation of a meaningful life. It's a deliberate choice to step away from the noise of societal expectations and discover the symphony within. In solitude, we become the authors of our narrative, crafting a story of authenticity and purpose that resonates with the timeless wisdom of Stoic philosophy. Imagine a busy professional caught in the whirlwind of meetings and deadlines. Amid this chaos, embracing solitude becomes a powerful choice. It's in those moments of quiet reflection that they can recalibrate, aligning their actions with their core values. The Stoic advice here is to see solitude not as isolation, but as a deliberate act of self-care, self-exploration and self-discovery. It's a tool for building an inner sanctuary that remains untouched by external storms. In the dichotomy of engagement with the world and embracing solitude, Stoicism teaches a harmonious balance. It's not about choosing one over the other, but recognising when each is most beneficial. Whether amidst the bustling crowd or in the tranquil embrace of solitude, Stoicism guides us toward a life rich in wisdom and purpose. Thank you for joining me on this. Until next time, be kind, be resilient, and may your virtues illuminate your path and many others ahead. See you in the next one. Subscribe. Like. Share.